right, guys. So the City of Miami Springs Parks and Recreation Department, uh, we're gonna go ahead and have a virtual learning uh, care program. Uh, basically, we understand fully that the school board and other private schools and even charter schools are not having uh, children go back into the classroom. So we realize that there are parents out there that need the services where they need to go to work and the parents wanna be able to take their children somewhere that they could do you know, their virtual learning in a safe and uh, an educational environment. So here at the City of Miami Springs Community Center, we're gonna be offering a virtual learning care program for children that are in kindergarten all the way to fifth grade, okay? We will be starting on August 31st. Uh, we will have a, um, a drop-off early oper uh, program if you feel that you need that service. So you would start, we would start the program at 7 a.m. and it would go all the way to 3.30 p.m. Okay, daily, Monday through Friday. We will also have an after school care if you also need that service. But if you don't, you can pick up your child at what we would call, you know, the end of uh, business uh, school day and then you can go from there. So the fees are right now, there's an $80 a week fee for the virtual learning care and an additional $35 a week for the after school care, all right? Um, basically, what we're gonna do is we're gonna make sure your students, you know, your, your child, the students are logged in. Uh, you know, they're, they're, they're when the times that you guys have told us through either their class syllabus or their agenda, uh, we'll make sure that they're going to be, you know, following their the guidelines that basically the, the teachers have put for them. Uh, we won't be teaching your child uh, we, we will not be doing any of that, but we'll make sure that we assist them and that they get online and they're doing things according to the curriculum that the teacher has set forth. We will follow CDC guidelines. We will provide each child with their own table and chair, and they'll be using that table and chair on a daily basis. They're not going to be moving around. That'll be their desk for the time of the program. Each station will have hand sanitizer, uh, hand sanitation stations, uh, uh, wipes or paper towels or anything of that nature. Uh, we ask you guys to please provide that to us so you feel comfortable with the product that you're providing. Um, we're going to make sure that our, our janitorial services clean up the area every night, plus we'll do it in the morning to make sure everything is sanitized and ready to go. All right. Uh, we will ask you, laptop, iPad, please have them fully charged the night before and also bring the chargers with you. Okay. Headphones so that we don't have a loud where different kids have their, their, their volumes up. So they must have their headphones on. School supplies, which we will provide some basic school supplies. Uh, we're gonna provide pencils, papers, just in case a child doesn't bring those things. We have them ready and available, crayons, etc. We do ask you to please bring two face coverings in case one of them disappears or gets wet or something when they drink water. At least we have another one for, for face covering. Uh, lunch, it's important that you guys do bring lunch and snack. Uh, if a child doesn't have lunch or a snack, we will do our best to provide it for them. We'll contact you and see what's, you know, if they want McDonald's or something like that, we'll get that to you. And obviously a water bottle, which is important. So they have something to hydrate, okay? Again, space is limited. We will be following the CDC guidelines and suggested protocols, okay? We encourage you guys to call us if you have any questions at 305-805-5075, or you can email myself, Omar Luna, or Kaylin Smith, our emails on our city website for any questions. We do plan on having registration, I believe is Wednesday, August 19th at 6 p.m. It is first come, first serve, okay? Uh, the registration packet paperwork will be online where you can get that information. That way you have it ready, already filled out. When you come to do registration, we're ready to go. It's a quick process. It'll be here at the community center, first come, first serve, um, on August 19th at 6 p.m., okay? Uh, this is a new program. Uh, we will be following the guidelines very strict. We, we will be providing a safe environment for your children. Uh, we will make sure that they're online, that they're doing what they have to do, that they're following their, 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 you know, their assignments and things like that. Uh, but we do encourage you guys to help us out with that a lot so that we know exactly what it is that you want your child to be doing. Uh, with that said, if you have any questions or concerns, again, you can contact us or email us, and we'll be more than welcome to give you guys as much information as possible. Until then, stay safe, be healthy. See you guys soon.